we mentioned Erling Haaland. His stats are ridiculous. 14 goals, 10 games. I mean, are we going to be looking back on him in 10 years' time saying he's like a Premier League great? You know, where, where will he stand, do you think? Well, I, th I think he's, stand he's standing as, as an exceptional player already. I mean, he was before he, before he came here. It did make me laugh at, uh, at the start of the season, the Community Shield, when he didn't necessarily have the best time <laughs> and people were talking about the number of touches he had. Yes. And I was going, have you watched him in the Champions League? Have you watched him play for his country? He's, he's an exceptional talent. He can score all types of goals. But he just brings something extra to Manchester City in terms of getting in the box and that athleticism. I mean, you know, Pep Guardiola, who's seen so much of the, the game, uh, he then described his goal the other day, mm. almost like the sort of kung fu when he rose yes, to sort of flick the ball in, goal. as reminding him of um, a Johan Cruyff goal for, uh, for, for Barcelona mm. and for Pep Guardiola to use a comparison like that. There's probably no greater praise. So, you know, f fantastic player. But what I like about him is when you listen to his interviews, he's always saying, well, I could have done better or, you know, another player could have done better. He's very young, driven, wants to improve, totally dedicated. And to, to your point about in 10 years' time, we'll be looking back and saying he's one of the greats. Mm. I think in 10 months' time we might be. <laughs> wow. I mean, I'll give you another one of his stats because I just love looking at them all day yesterday. 100 goals in his last 99 games Sorry, since he. Uh, I think every week we're going to have to have like, Harland watch on the show <laughs> because he's just going to he's going to rip it up. I mean, I know he was talking about Roy, Johan Cruyff for uh, Pep yesterday. For older viewers like me, it's like, more like Chuck Norris, you know, <laughs> so on the back post. It's just a fabulous kind of kung fu kick and you kind of see bad guys getting skittled all over the place. Um, I do want to give you a paper, though, just in case we go too wildly off track. Uh, just how many will he score? Because that's what everyone is asking mm. right now. Just look at the subject there as well. Even Dixie Dean's record in jeopardy. If Hotshot Harland can keep up phenomenal form. They've got a graph. A graph. They've got a graph, they've got the numbers, <laughs> the, the coverage is terrific, I've got, I've got to say. Ollie on Double Bubble, we just had him in the column here, but I want to read some of this match report as well. Every one of the single... Uh, listen, he says, now Dixie Dean's record of 1927-1928 is... Could, must surely be in sight. He says that Dixie Dean scored 20 goals that season, a total that for a long time has seemed otherworldly, to use his words. Since the Second World War, the great Jimmy Greaves, of course, got closest to matching it when he scored 41 for Chelsea in their 60-61 season. Early in the Premier League era, Andy Cole, Alan Shearer both managed 34, but now we are starting to wonder whether we may have to adjust our horizons after mm -hmm. Haaland scored his 11th goal in the seventh league games of his City career at Molyneux. You'd agree with that, wouldn't you? I would. He's got to stay clear of injury, the most mm. important thing. He's not going to the World Cup, so he'll get a rather nice... Um, Break. mid winter break mm -hmm. and he'll be unleashed on teams in the second half of the season I think certainly the more recent numbers Shearer and Cole may be within range Okay. Well, why not the Dean number? Dixie Dean, yeah. 60. 60 I mean look that, that would be phenomenal Dixie Dean has I a, know that seems a silly question but I just think the rate he's question. scoring legit, out at yeah. the moment it just does look as though he can be anything he wants to be this season. Yeah, he, he, he can be, but that is a huge number. I mean, that is a phenomenal number. And I mean, talk to Everton fans about that. You know, but look, the great thing about someone like Holland is that he won't be fettered by history. Mm -hmm. He will just think, how, what, how many can I score for this team with this sort of service, particularly but from De Bruyne? 